Hi everyone, happy Monday. It's Miss Alba checking in with a Bible story for this week. This week, the Bible story I'm going to read is titled Lydia. Some of you may know my youngest daughter's name is Lydia, so this story holds special meaning for me. Listen carefully as we hear about Paul's visit to Lydia and what happens to Lydia and her family and friends after meeting Paul. Here we go. Paul traveled to many places teaching people about Jesus. One night, God told Paul, go to another country and teach the people there. Paul listened to God. He got on a very big boat. Up and down over the waves, the boat went, sailing to a faraway country. When he got there, Paul taught everyone, saying, Jesus loves you. And Jesus came to earth to teach us how to live and has saved us from all our sins. An amazing woman named Lydia heard Paul teaching. Unlike many other women of her time, Lydia had her own business. She sold beautiful, expensive purple cloth to the rich and famous. Lydia said to Paul, tell me more about Jesus. I want to learn everything I can about the Son of God. And here's a picture of Paul with Lydia and her purple cloth. Paul told her about Jesus' teachings. Love everyone, he said. Share with others, he continued. And most importantly, he finished, remember that God loves you forever. Lydia was amazed. She'd never heard about Jesus before. I want to be one of Jesus' followers, she said. Will you baptize me and everyone in my household? Lydia, Paul, and all the people who lived in Lydia's house went to the water. They splashed into the cool waters. And then Paul baptized each of them, saying, I baptize you in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Lydia said, Thank you. Will you stay at my house with my family? And Paul said, sure, and went to stay with Lydia. Lydia became a follower of Jesus. She was very generous, using her money to help many people. Jesus loves you, she told as many people as she could. Jesus has saved you from your sins. Follow Jesus. He is the Son of God. Many people learn from Lydia, the amazing woman who sold purple cloth. And here's a picture down at the river with Paul and Lydia and her family getting baptized. I hope you've had a chance to share about Jesus and how much he loves everyone with your friends and your family, your brothers and your sisters and anyone you've come into contact these last few weeks. If you can believe it, we have just two weeks left of school and it just doesn't seem possible. I miss seeing each of you very much. I hope you're doing well in your classes and you're working really hard these last two weeks. Just do your very, very best. Put all that effort and energy into your assignments and, and make your parents and your teachers so proud of you. I know you can do it. I believe in you. I miss seeing each of your faces and I look forward to a time when we can be together again. Have a wonderful week, everyone. Bye-bye.